It's time to face the truth with Jason Henderson. Facing the truth can be hard, but it's necessary. Now face the truth with Jason Henderson. Welcome back to the Face the Truth show. I got my brother, Keith Wonderboy. We had to have him call in, so hopefully you guys can hear him. Keith, say what's up to the people. How you doing, man? Man, I'm good, man. I, no need complaining. So, um, thank thank you for coming in, man. I'm I'm okay. so excited to have you on the show, man. Let's let's take it back. Let's go back. I met you, Keith, when you was about 10, 11 years old. Had to be. Right. And uh-huh. you you was coming by my church, the Glorious Church of God in Christ, killing, yeah. killing, killing. <laughs> I mean, Killing, man! You have been doing this. Gotta be over thirty years now, man. How how you feel yeah. about that? I've been exactly. I know. I just got my numbers together this year. On uh, forty two years, and you, then on the on the national level, twenty one years. You've been doing this for forty two years. Yes. Good. I was five years old when my dad first gave me the mic. Now let me ask you this, Keith. How how do you feel? Cause to me, you 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 you're, you're a living legend in, in quartet music. Straight up, how, how do you feel when people call you stuff like that? Like when they say you're a legend. Um, when when you hear somebody say things like you're a living legend, how does that make you feel? Well, next is so good, and then you it makes it make it really brings me to reality that I've been doing this a long time, and how how we say it makes it feel funny that don't date me, man, don't date. Don't date me. <laughs> <laughs> but I literally I had to come to the conclusion. That's forty two years I've been doing this. Who's your favorite new quartet group or singer? Who's your favorite new guy? The new cats coming up. Uh, I got a few of them. Uh, like Tim Rogers. Okay. Well, I actually introduced Tim Rogers to the industry on a CD that I did. Keith Wonderwood Johnson presents the uh, Rising Stars of Court Set. And I put Tim Rogers on that CD, and the rest is history. Wow. <laughs> wow. And uh, I like, well, I was really getting into, I had became a brother who had uh, Sean Jones. Okay. So, uh, I like the Williams Singers. Oh, yeah, I love them. Those are my homies. And uh, then you got some other new guys that just came out. Uh, uh, DM, DM Morton. He's from Jersey, too. Uh, he, he's a business lead. DM Morton. We call him Chubb. He, there's some new guys out there. Wow. Oh, I like Lisa Knowles, too. I can't leave the females out. Lisa Knowles and then these some young ladies out of Georgia called Blessed. They're pretty tight, too. Okay. Okay. Now, you just put out a new single. Um, right. What's the name of the single? I Believe. Believe in Yourself. Believe in Yourself. Now, I got to tell you, when I when you sent me the record yesterday and I listened to it, I was like, that don't sound like <laughs> something Keith would do. <laughs> yeah, man. What made you What made you go so extreme far from what we know and what we love about Keith Wonderboy Johnson? Yeah. Well, I'll be saying, you know, I look at our world today. You know, the world is turning, and, you know, a lot of people saying they, they try to move forward and do this and do that. But what we have to do, we, we are guilty of practicing insanity. We're doing the same thing, expecting different results. Wow. So, hey... You know, I, I'm not, I'm not, I'm one to take, I'm a risk taker, so, uh, you know, I, I, I said we need to do something different, so when we came up with that song, you know, now, did I you, said, you wrote that song? That's <laughs> why, you know, and I'm still waiting to, you know, work with Pastor J.N. because I'm a risk taker. Ah! That's, that's definitely, Listen. definitely, you know, they, they don't know, we go, we go way, way back and. You know, Pastor J. Hen always gives me some stuff. I can't handle it. I'm not vocally, vocally challenged, but I can't be doing that stuff. He, 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 you know what? You need to <laughs> stop it, man. <laughs> 
Now, we did get a chance to work together on one project that me and right. Dave Caton produced. And uh, right. I wrote a song with Dave uh, called I'll Praise You. Yes, and, that is the most soulful for sure. Yeah. Yeah. So we got to do it again. Mm -hmm. so I, I've been pro that. It is so much talent. Forget the world. It's so much talent in our metro, you know, area, our metro community. So we all, we just got to work with each other. We don't have to use outside. It's so true, man. It's so true. And let me tell you, that, that had to be one of the most pivotal moments of my a career as a songwriter to have you, Bishop Daryl McFadden, and Spanky all on the same song. That was like completely crazy. Completely yeah, crazy. Y'all guys are like my favorite quartet singers, man. And yeah. um it was just it was just an honor. So you 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 said that live on the air, you know that, right Keith? That means you gotta do something together. You 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 know you said that live on the air, right? Yeah, yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. We're going to hold you to it. We're going to hold you oh, to no, it. No, that's not a problem, dude. For real. That is not a problem. That's, yeah. Trust me. I, I, I always say, see, what we got right there, it was crazy about it. It's right there in the metropolitan area. So we ain't even counting when you start going out and involving Jersey and Connecticut, just in New York alone. And when a lot of people don't realize when you look at what a lot what a lot of guys are doing and they and I'll be like, Oh man, we grew up together, man. Right, blah, right. Blah, blah, blah. We used to, you know I used to play in uh we played uh P A L basketball league. I used to play against Danny Easton and all That's crazy. <laughs> we came up together, man. That's crazy. So so what 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 should we expect from Keith Wonderboy coming up for the rest of this the year? The unexpected. The unexpected. Because I'm telling you, this this new single that you got, bro, I love it, yeah. but it completely, yeah, it caught me off guard. I ain't going to lie to you. I want to, I'm trying to get everybody to believe in yourself all over the world. So I'm just, I'm not just in the church walls. I'm talking about, I just, it's, you know, I want, this is for a song for the nation. Oh, that's great, man. Now, I, I saw that you were just shooting a video. When is the video going to be completed? Uh, the video is uh, going to be out by August. Okay, great, great, yeah. great. I was so. trying to get it uh, ready for the GMWA. Uh -huh. because of course, I, with our own with, with Bishop Jameson, man, they, they telling me some things that it's going to be all kind of screens and everything throughout it. So I sure want my video to be shown, so I'm trying to push it up. Yeah. So it can at least be ready to show by the, by the two end of the That would be great, man. Well, Keith, man, I know you're busy, and um, we really wish we could have got you on live with us. Um, so next time you come, man, you got to come back, and you got to, you know, get on, get on the live so people can see you. And we really wanted people to um, be able to just, you know, hear your heart. Um, as far as where, matter of fact, before you go, man, just, just answer this last question. Where do you see gospel music going in the next 10 years? Uh, I, I feel there's no telling where, if, you know, if the possibility to go, I, I feel it just depends on the, the, the um, the ears and who, who gives the, the opportunity. And then I, I just look at in my own personal circle. Just like, you know, when we look at people like me, our friends, you know, I got friends all over that's in some strong places, you know. Uh, we got childhood friends, you, you know, we like look at uh, Gene people grew up with us. Yeah. He's the M MD for everything under the new edition umbrella. Wow. And, you know, you look at the other day, I was saying uh, Jennifer, uh, Jennifer Hudson. You know, she's singing one of the Can't Spirit songs, wow. you know. And, you know, just like uh, God, uh, gospel is so big, man. At any given time, people now, uh, nowadays, it's so serious. People are going, coming to Jesus Christ now, man. So it all depends on the vessel. Yeah. I'm sure the sky is the limit. That's so true. And uh, I heard, I heard you was on the Jones Boys Projects. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you know those those are those are some of my favorite uh, singers as well. Uh, Earl and yeah. Booty, those those fellas can sing, man. And I, I heard you on there, and uh, there was only one thing missing from that song. You come on here, you and the Holy Ghost, Doc. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm like. Because what's crazy, it's still the same circle. Yeah, remember that now. Y'all remember my echo? I always be like, yo, we in the same circle, so we might as well come together. So this is my se actually my second time working um um working with the Jones brothers, and how I even got introduced to the Jones brothers. I actually grew up with their grandfather, so I knew of them. But as far as Earl and his vocals, I was actually uh like networking with Dave Cake. Okay. And he's giving me some tracks. He's giving me some demo tracks. Like, yo, you can, I'm like, and he played this one track that was in the, that element of the stuff y'all was working with. And mm -hmm. I was like, who is that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and he was like, that's Earl Jones. I was like, well, I don't call him, but dude, I can't touch that. Ah. He, that. <laughs> don't walk I was like, so I, I just feel, man, we make, we might make it this. You know, now with me having a record company, and I, I just want to, I might have to just do a, a compilation project and call it New York Talent, man. That would be the most banging it. Banging, we got the musicians, the vocalists, and everything, you know. That's, that's just the man. Yeah, man, because, you, know, you know, I... This guy, if I do a book, you, you have a book by your, your, yourself. Yeah, man, it is crazy. It's crazy. And so then you gonna make me take my sticks out, cause people don't realize we all used to be the church drummers battling, you know, playing for these churches. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Now I'm gonna tell you about Earl Jones. A lot of people don't know. I, I pride myself on being one of the first people to realize the greatness in 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 Pastor. Errol Jones, he's on my very first record. Um, me and him did a joint call together. Y'all the one I want. And uh -huh. when I heard this dude sing, I was like, "Yo, he's crazy." Then Timothy Wright grabbed him. Then, I mean, different ones started grabbing him. But you know, he, Earl just has one of them voices. When you hear it, you like, man, this guy's something special. Yeah. And uh, it, it was just a, a, a great thing working with I was Earl. blessed to be at his church when he got installed to be the pastor. Oh, nice, and nice. His, he was preaching and was riffing and was killing me. Oh, <laughs> yeah, man. He's crazy. Now, you think Earl can preach his daddy. His daddy is a yeah. monster. A monster. I come up, I came up with him. And then their grandfather went to Concord. So I was, I was seeing him the whole time. But they different, man. It's just so many. These family, man. It's just. It's something in that DNA. I'm, it's something. I'm looking forward. To, I'm looking forward to the gospel, but I'm I'm looking forward to the New York talent, to where we going. Yeah. And we got then we got a whole nother, like you said, we got a whole nother generation now coming behind me. I'm a behind us. That's ridiculous, man. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they're totally crazy. The stuff that they're thinking of is just phenomenal. And um, it's just I'm just glad to be a part. And I, I, I'm thankful, Keith, that God has blessed us to remain relevant and, and yes. a part of all of this that's going on for all these years, man. That, that, that speaks volumes, how God has sustained us and took us from the drums to what we're doing now. It's crazy. Yeah, man. It's crazy, man. So I, I celebrate your success. I'm I'm really thankful for you uh, because again, I I think that you don't get the credit that you deserve in quartet music. I I, I really think that you are one of quartet's unsung heroes because. Oh man, I appreciate. It. No, seriously, man. Anybody that's been doing anything all these years that that speaks volumes of your tenacity. It speaks volumes of your stick to itiveness. It speaks volumes of, you know, how humble you are, man. Because I, I've seen you stomping with the big dogs. I've seen you stomp and you held your own with people like Harvey and, you know, Lee Williams. I mean, 
when people in New York really don't know how big you are, dog. They really don't know <laughs> how how people all over the country honor and respect you. But that's just Bible. You know, most of us yeah, are not man. received or honored the way we should be honored in our hometown. But, um, dude, you are a living legend. And I want to take time to publicly thank you for the example of work ethic that you have shown me over the years up close and from afar because like I said I was blessed to be able to produce a record that you were on along with my brother Dave Caton and um yeah. just There's to see more to come man yeah I, man I believe, I've been, been talking that I know that for a fact man yeah There's more to come for sure yeah man sure. so get just keep doing what you're doing man and 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 if people want to find you Keith they want to find you on social media they want to contact yeah. you how, how do they find you Facebook is at Keith Wonderboy Johnson or Keith Wonderboy Johnson Roman Mueller Two, and uh, Instagram is at Keith Wonderboy Johnson. Twitter is at Keith Wonderboy J, and even the old fashioned ones that's a little behind like me. You can email me at Keith Wonderboy Johnson at gmail Come on here, email. Come on here. <laughs> <laughs> well, Keith, man, I want you to to just continue to be blessed, man, and continue. To blaze the trail that you're blazing, man, because we're standing on your shoulders, man. I'm definitely a recipient of uh, a lot of opportunities that you have created for me personally with my music. And um, the one thing I love about you is you always reach back, man. You always try to 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 open up doors for us, man. So we appreciate you. So right now we 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 want everybody to make uh, it your business to download. Keith's, Keith's new single and what's the single again Keith what is it called Believe in Yourself Believe in Yourself we get ready to play it right now y'all on Face the Truth and I want to give a big shout out again to all y'all that have tuned in to uh, the Face Face the Truth on Faith Expressions Gospel Radio with your boy Jay Hen and I'm going to allow Keith to do the honors Keith introduce your brand new single. Everybody have an amazing weekend and stay hydrated, guys, because it's hot out here. But as hot as the weather is, we got some hot music here on Faith Expressions Gospel Radio where we play that Jesus music. Keith, introduce your new single to everybody. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, introduce to you the new single from the inspirational project, Believe in Yourself. That was my boy, Keith Wonder Boy. And, uh, all you guys, please download his new single, Believe in Yourself. We had some uh, technical difficulty, but thank you guys for hanging in. And hopefully you guys were able to hear him because uh, we definitely going to get him on the show the right way. And uh, But, you know, you got to do what you got to do, guys. So remember, this is your time. It's your season. I love you guys on the Face the Truth show with your boy, Jay Hen on Faith Expressions Gospel Radio, where we play that Jesus music all day long, y'all. Peace. You've been listening to Face the Truth with Jason Hendrickson, heard each Friday at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, 8 p.m. Central, 7 p.m. Mountain, and 6 p.m. Pacific on Faith Expressions Gospel Radio. And now, here it is, the brand new single from Keith Wonderboy Johnson, Believe in You.